Now let's turn to the ongoing World Economic Forum in Davos, Switzerland. Germany and Britain have called for a global economic watchdog, an overseer with strengthened powers to prevent rather than react to a financial crisis. Guo Yihua has more. German Chancellor Angela Merkel has called for the creation of a United Nations Economic Council similar to the UN Security Council. Merkel stressed that economic principles needed to be laid out in the new charter, which could form the basis of such an international body. We might, for example, build on a charter that we could agree on among the G20. This may lead to the establishment of a UN Economic Council, just as the Security Council was created after the Second World War. Just allow me to remind all of us of what we succeeded in doing then. After the terrible times and the terrible crimes committed by the National Socialists in my country. Chairman of the group of 20 British Prime Minister Gordon Brown says bold action is needed to get banks lending again and repair the financial damage. Brown also warned against a protectionist retreat into what he called financial mercantilism. He said such a move would leave the world poorer and ultimately lead to more traditional forms of trade barriers. This uh, financial mercantilism, which is foreign banks retreating to their home base, will, if we do nothing, lead to a new form of protectionism, indeed a deglobalization that would lead to a reduction in trade and cross-border business, cross business activity, and which would be followed quickly by old trade protectionism of the past. But there was little sign that trade ministers were approaching a breakthrough in the long-stalled Doha round of World Trade Talks. Meetings are expected to continue through the weekend. Guo Yuhua, CCTV.